Hey everyone, Wikijado here. Time for another Build My Bases. Today we're continuing our build with Fairwater Prestige 7. Um, so where we left off yesterday is we started um, kind of redesigning this end goal state of um, trying to like reposition this um, this these set of bombs um, and to try and like the idea here is like we're trying to both uh, let the warmongers kind of escape out um, so they've got a place to drop down um, but also we're, we're trying to um, get this bomb split to work so that bombs will split straight down to its right if we're, we're kind of looking this way um, and then forward as well we want it to split as well into these kind of tiles here so that that's the idea the idea here is like maybe raiders are trying to quickly escape from these warmongers which i've seen a few replays now trying to just escape out so we're trying to prevent that and like kind of force them to come back and fight these warmongers rather than just kind of go forwards with no impedance so that that's the idea um, we might still need to tweak this a little bit um, but for now for prestige 7 um, this is kind of the setup we're looking at um, so we'll need to make changes to these warmongers okay but let's think let's think about this we want to put this here to kind of create sound just above um, and I think yeah like if we just do that right let's just go go crazy go wild because <laughs> we're, we're trying to make as much noise as possible to kind of mask the fact that there's that there are um, warmongers up here um, Kind of what we're going for anyway. Um, this could also be revealed. How much capacity have we got? Okay, hang on. Can we place these warmongers? I think that's where we got up to last time. Was we were about to place those warmongers. Right, so that that's the original holding pen. But that's no longer gonna, gonna work because of okay hang on let, let us think about this uh... Cause I'm trying to think like maybe we could well they're, they're gonna bunch up all here right so unless we kind of did something like this would be there too. But these ones we can change. Okay. I'm just gonna kind of redo a little bit of this. Yeah, because we could maybe do something like like here and then it goes up like that. But that would need to be there. Okay. So far so good. And then the bomb split needs to kind of funnel stuff this way too. Okay, so kind of like that, right? Um, and then like that. Uh, and I don't think we need this anymore, right? We should be able to just do that and that should be enough. So. Half of the split will go this way and into these tiles and then the other half should hopefully either roll here or more importantly here as well. I'm just trying to think. Uh, do we have... we don't have mods. Can we add mods? Well, before we go wild with mods, let's get those um, warmongers up. I think is more important. Because we can always add mods later. 
Uh, that would need to be there. Okay. One, two, three. So this is kind of the holding pen. question is, I think we kind of need three, right? But we also, well mods we can, we can add later. Um, is there anything else we can cut? I think maybe cut this one. Oh, that's right. That's right, that's right. Let's cut it for, for Prestige 7. We can add that flame trap for Prestige 8. I'd rather get the Warmongers in, because it creates more pressure. Okay, so that's that. Uh, and then we still need a Parthen, but we'll get to that. And these have second wave. Got it. Not second wave. This needs second wave, otherwise that's useless. Okay, looks good, I think. I think, I think. Then that will split that way, and the idea is it will split again to like down straight here and forward. Okay, cool. Yep, uh, I'm happy with that. So let's, uh, I, I realized I didn't set my timer. That right now. Okay. Okay, so let's let's path these warmongers. Whoops. Oh, before we do that, do we have enough capacity for um, mods? So I th yeah, we don't. Damn. And I don't really want to remove any more of these. Right. Okay. We'll we'll leave it for Prestige Eight. Uh, is the the bomb mods and uh, that extra flame trap should be fine. Okay. So let's record this. Just gotta be careful with the pathing so they don't um, kill themselves. And what we'll do is we'll go all the way here and come back. Because we assume that... Okay. Maybe we just... We'll, we'll just leave them to there. Okay. they face that way, they should actually stand guard there. That's right, we can record them. Because we just don't really want them to be all bunched up. Um, at that little... Uh, X 
exit there or entryway. Okay, all the way to there and then to like here or something. Maybe we place him a little bit back. Okay. And then it's just these bottom warmongers we need a path. Then we should be good. And we'll test this as well to make sure they don't explode with the dead man switch and stuff like that. Kind of just leave him back there, and we just got one more to path. That should be good to go. Or maybe like place him here. Cool. Um, I think that's it. Uh. If I'm not mistaken, uh, we're at five seven six eight of five seven seven five, so about seven capacity left over. Yeah, I'd really next prestige eight. I'd love to get um, mods on this. This is like really important because otherwise you don't get the bounce and the the spring load from chaos and spring load. Um, and then next was adding back in this flame trap. Um, and then I think we're good, like in terms of like what stuff I really wanted for this base. Um, the only other stuff I could think of is like maybe, oh right, we couldn't put a bomb trap here because it would explode onto, um, it would explode these guys, unless we added a delay, but I think the reason we didn't want to add a delay at least at this stage is it would delay the pressure of like the the kind of um, sandwiching of the two warmongers. Like the more we delay there, the less pressure raiders have when they get to here when they meet the other side of the warmonger set. So I think if they can try to arrive together, um, it will make even more pressure. So that, that's kind of the idea. These are here to mask sound. Uh, we, we can even add crap here, just to enhance that. Um, but otherwise, yeah, I think we're, we're good. They just make so much damn noise. <laughs> you know what I mean? They make so much noise. Now let's just go wild in here. The more, like, noise generators, the better, right? It's like the less chance of people hearing everything. <laughs> Nothing sus at all. <laughs> okay, cool. That looks good to me. Um, I think we're ready to test, to be honest. Alright, so let's maybe test from way back here. And I'll, I'll kind of... Oh, okay. Not sure why it's in so short, but sure. We'll test all the way back here. Just kind of speed through this, like, not trying to, like, destroy the base or anything. I'm just trying to... Just trying to get through that piece as 
best we can. Okay, cool. Right, so what we're trying to listen out for is warmongers. But this, this looks good. One nice thing about the, um, the concrete is it does look a lot like the bedrock. Like, I, I'm colorblind, but like this and this, to me, look the same. Or at least very similar, right, in, in terms of color. So, that's kind of the idea. Okay. See, I reckon we need uh, noisemakers here. We, we don't even hear that. That's the great thing about this. Okay. Sorry. Uh, um, let's test again from here. Maybe it's better there is no um, noisemakers, because otherwise it raises suspicion, if you know what I mean. Well, it does potentially mask... Um, what the... Oh, of course. Got it. Alright, let, let's spawn up here. Be this is all because we, we moved them onto that piston path before they, they weren't on the piston path. Okay. That's fine. Just make this little change. Just doing this should actually be enough. Okay, alright. Let's grab it. Just let go through it. Yeah, like, th this already is enough to push me down, and then guess what? More, more crap from the other side, so... Um, I think that's good. Uh, like, I I'm happy with that timing. Um, now let's test the... this. Okay. Yeah, th this is great. This is, like... Where does that kit to? To about here. Okay. Yeah, I I'm happy with that. So, yeah, there, it's like just up into here, I think, is where the box, yeah, the box kind of lands, so, um, yeah, I, I don't think, like, the only, like I said before, I think Chaos and Spring Load will help distribute those bombs out faster, um, and potentially further as well, like, we could even potentially get bombs all the way out here. Um, if we tweaked this block to also be um, an opaque cube, but for now uh, I'm fine with it not being a corrosive yet. We we'll just have to keep in mind for Prestige 8, we'll swap that out to uh, a corrosive cube. We may even want to then move this up even higher, like one more, but again, that, that can wait to Prestige 8. So. Um, let's just move to a quieter a spot. <laughs> um, man. Minions just make so much noise. Um, so with that, um, thanks everyone for watching. If you like this kind of content, consider liking and subscribing. It really helps us out. And we will see you in the next one.